From our homes to our newspapers, we do lots with trees. But one thing we don't do is eat them, which is why the idea of turning them into biofuel is more appealing than using sources like corn. George Huber of the University of Massachusetts Amherst and his team have found a way to do just that. Our process would uh, basically make gasoline that looks like the gasoline in our tank today. Writing in the journal Chemistry and Sustainability, Energy and Materials, the researchers showed that converting plant cellulose is both possible and relatively simple. The whole beauty of this process is the simplicity. We, we do everything in one single reactor, one single step. Huber says a key part of the process takes less than two minutes, while a similar step for biodiesel can take 10 days. He says a sustainable use of trees and other non-edible plant material could supply 60 percent of the nation's gasoline. And Huber adds, when compared to a barrel of oil, trees cost less. Well, the cost right now of that biomass is between uh, 10 to 30 dollars per barrel of oil energy equivalents. So far, Huber's team has only made a few small vials of the fuel. But if he develops a way to produce it on a commercial scale, one of these days our streets might be teeming with tree-powered traffic. I'm Brad Closel.